The game's future stars are on and display now, as minor league up. baseball comes your Yo, way on the show. Tennessee Time for game two Smokies. of the regular season between the Mississippi Braves and the Tennessee Smokies. It's baseball on the show and it's coming up next. Coming to the plate now, number 87. He'll get us started in this Leading one under the lights. The third baseman, number 87. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Line toward the gap in left center. And this is into the alley and ought to be good for extra bases. And he will coast into second with a leadoff double. If that's any indication, I think we're going to see some aggressive at-bats in this one. Take the first pitch of the game? No way. He squared it up and winds up on second base after a nice line drive. Great opportunity to get on the board right out of the box. Batting second. The right field. Now to the plate, Ryan, Ryan. Lamar. Great chance Lamar. to drive in a run here in the early going. The one-two. Hit on the ground to third. Come on, you can beat it, you can beat it. And that's the first out. And now we'll look at the starting lineup for the visitors in this one. Dero, what you got on this lineup tonight? Well, Matty, you take a look at this lineup filled with young bloods, just young guys, hungry, aggressive, trying to do damage and move traffic to both gaps. Line to line power up and down this lineup. Should be interesting to see if this pitcher uses their aggressiveness against them. Into the box third. now, Chad Dunn. Fielder. He'll get to take his Chad. first cuts here. Dunn. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. There you go. Find this it. This is hit Find softly it. to third. Throw on to first. Oh, two gone. Into the box. Stanley that Matsui. As he'll get his leader. first opportunity in this Stanley. one. Stanley Matsui. Here's a swing and oh man. Way out of here. It's a two run shot to straight away left. First home run of the campaign for him, as it's now a two nothing ball game. Wow, that's what a pitcher gets for not putting what he thought was a bad call in the rear view mirror. I think he was still fuming and didn't get the pitch where he wanted it. The result? A reason to be even more mad. Into the box now, number 87. Runner number in scoring 87. position with two gone. He's set and the pitch. Line toward the alley in left center. Florimon is on his way home. Now a long throw home, but this won't be in time as he's well safe and the run scores. Here now is Ryan Lamar. He's 0 for 1 after now grounding Ryan. out in Light his fielder. only trip to the plate Ryan. so far. Lamar. The 0 1 pitch. And there he goes towards second. Pitch is high. The throw. Uh, the throw pulls him off the bag. Well, the difference between a caught stealing and a stolen base is often pretty small, and that was a really good example. If that throw didn't make the fielder reach across his body a little bit, I think he could have been out. Yeah, Dan, the throw wasn't all that bad, but it did end up a little more on the third base side of the bag, and that may have been the difference. The 1-1 home is oh. taken below the zone for a ball. Two out here and a runner at second. Come on, go on, you're scoring, you're scoring, go on. Center. Aiken moving in. He gets there to make the catch, and that ends the inning. So one run here, one hit, one error in the inning, and a runner left. On now to the bottom of the second. Mississippi leads it four to nothing. 
Now at the plate, Taylor Davis. Batting sixth. The catcher, Taylor. Bases are empty, one man out. Davis. One, one, Ground ball one. to third. Fielded cleanly. Throw gets him. Oh. Two down. Digging in the switch hitter, number 87. Off, he doubled earlier and carries a two for two line into this number appearance. 87. Third baseman in tight, protecting the bunt, the first pitch. Yeah, make the turn, pick up the ball. Line drive, base hit. Well, Dan, the sun goes down and this guy lights up right here. That's his third knock of the night. Uh, talk about having a good night, three hits, and hey, he might have another at bat or two before this one ends. Now at the plate, Ryan Lamar. He's bounced out now and batting. flown out in Mike his first Cuba. two plate appearances. Ryan Lamar. He's set. Here's the 2 2. And a big cut at the breaking ball, but he comes up empty, and that's the first out. Coming to the plate now, Chad Dunn. The he singled his last 11. time up. Chad Dunn. Bit of a surprise here as he's going to try to lay one down. And the throw is laid at first, so they can't get anybody out. Standing in, Stanley Matsui. The left fielder, number eight. Stanley Matsui. Now a ball lined toward the gap in left center. And that's into the hold outfield on, on, for right a one-out hit. Boy, there's a bullet base hit right there, but you have to hold there, D-Row, to make sure that gets down and isn't caught for a line drive double play. Yeah, you have to play the game right there and respect the infield and respect the line drive. I know he wants to get a ribby for his buddy, but that's the way the game's played. Digging in to try it again. Miguel Arias already two for two. He'll look to add Miguel on right here. Arias. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Moving under it. Aiken. He makes the catch. Here comes the runner from third. And he is under the tag at home. It's a 5 nothing game now. You'd have thought someone had a radar gun on him with the effort he put into that throw. That's a cannon of an arm right there. Digging in, number 87. He's got three number hits, including a double to this point. First offering on its way. Swing, line, drive. Turn, That's going to be turn. trouble. And this one bounds around against the wall. And he'll pull into second with his fourth hit of the ball game. Left fielder really never had a chance at that one at all. It was over his head before he knew it, bouncing off the base of the wall for an easy double. Those are the kind of shots anyone would feel good about. So striding forward now, now Ryan batting. Lamar. Right he could field. really use a knock Ryan. here. 0 for 3 in the Lamar. game so far. From the belt, the pitch. Here's swung right. on and missed, and that's the final out of the inning. Danger averted following the two-out double. We're back to Friday Night Baseball on the show after this. Now batting. The catcher, Frank. And a ground ball to third. Reined in. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Nothing across here this half. We're through six full. Mississippi's out in front, six to one. 
Now back to the top of the lineup, Al stepping Batty. in number, number 87. 87. And he's trying to make this a five hit ball game for himself right here. From the stretch, here's the pitch. This is line to left, and a dive, but it rattles in and out of the glove. The throw into second, not in time, and he's in there with a double. Boy, and they have not been able to get him out. This is now a five-hit ball game for him here, and those don't come along every day. So digging in now, Ryan Lamar. Now, he looked to bounce back right after fielder. striking out his Ryan. last time up. Yeah, Maddie, big time K last time up, and it's been a tough series for him so far. You can tell he's just not seeing the ball off this team. Let's see if he can make an adjustment right here. Digging in now, Chad Dunn. He looked the to keep it going three for 11. four so far Chad in the ball game. Dunn. Now the three and two pitch. Curveball, but a good job to lay off, and he works out the free pass. Yeah, well, when a guy's swinging the bat as well as he's been, this is a smart move. No reason to tempt fate out there. Next will be the cleanup hitter, now Stanley batting. Matsui. He went deep hitter. earlier, and he's Stanley. two for four to this point. Matsui. And a fastball swung on and missed as they set him down for the second time here tonight. No runs, a hit, two left. Not too many more shots left. Home half of the eighth coming up. Mississippi leads it 9-1. to one. Digging in, Adolfo Acosta. Now batting, third baseman, Adolfo Acosta. Straight High pop-up, up. Up. number 87, moving to his left, and he makes the catch for the second out. At the plate, Ray Clemens. He now got batting. called out on First strikes base his base. last time through. Ray. Yeah, always frustrating Clemens. to go down looking. Everybody does it, though. You'll have a few ABs where you get completely. Look for him to be. Oh, and he snags it out of midair, and that ends the inning. This one pretty well in the bag. We've played eight full. Mississippi's out in front, nine to one. And this will wind up being one of those kind of saves you used to see back in the 70s. I'll tell you, he was on fumes at the end there, but he found a way to get it done. Nine to one is the way this one ends. Mississippi hosted a three run first to propel them to the win. Colby Allard earns his first win of the season. Stephen Forbes was only able to work four innings as he takes the loss. So that's a wrap here tonight. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Twitter at MLB The Show.